Hello, it's Richard at Richard's Guitars. Um, this is a, a very, very relevant guitar. Uh, probably one of the most relevant guitars in my shop to me, personally. Um, some of you will hopefully recognize it. It is a Firch, or Firch, um, the logo. Um, Firch described their brand as Firch, I think. Um, but as I may have mentioned on previous occasions, I think it sounds like I'm clearing my throat when I'm saying it badly. So I call it Firsh. I soften it, so don't, don't, don't worry about the way I'm calling it. I know it's probably wrong. Um, so Firsh. Um, and this is a, a blue series, which I'll try and say without smiling, because I'll come on to that in a minute. This is the Firsh blue series, GCMC, which is C the top, mahogany back and sides, and a cutaway, CMC. And they are the most extraordinary guitars that I've ever heard at this price. And this is kind of the guitar that really, this and another one or two maybe in the range, but this was the one that kind of really was the death knell for my sales of what I describe as mainstream guitars um, at the time, 10 years ago. So when I started doing this, probably 12, 13 years ago. Um, I think I think it's been that long, 12 years ago. And um, so I'm just gonna play just one simple chord. In fact, I, I just, just picked it up and I just wanna sort of play, I don't know how this is gonna come across, so I'm just gonna play his first note. And this is a G body, so it's not, it's not meant to have completely overpowering bass, but, and I played that just fairly gently. I'll play it again, a bit louder. That's a bit louder again. I can still feel that running through the body of the guitar. I have a, um, a way of kind of testing my excitement levels of guitars. Um, I, I, even as I talk across the top of this guitar, my the energy from my voice is going into the guitar, echoing around. But I'm just gonna, which shows kind of how resonant it is, but I'm just gonna do this. Oh, you may not have heard that, so I'm gonna do it again nearer to you, if hopefully you can hear this. So I hope that comes across because to me it just makes me puts the hairs up on the backs of my arms and I it is just the most ridiculously alive uh, resonant guitar with true depth uh, it's beautiful and so here's the here's just a chord now listen to the notes it chimes and there's detail it chimes, yet it's not thin and tinny. It's bright, but it's not kind of like, it's clear, it's clear is the word I'm looking for. Absolutely love them. Absolutely love this guitar. Um, I love the fact it's natural, simple, satin finish. I love the satin neck. It's a 45mm nut, which seems to fit my hand absolutely beautifully. It was this brand that kind of made me aware that how relevant to me 45mm nuts were. <laughs> um, um, so um, so that's the, that is the first or first blue series GCMC. Um, it takes over from what was called the 20 series um, GCMC. So the, it would have been called the G20 CMC. I'll put a link down below. Um, I just hope I've done it justice because, I mean, look at that saddle height on there. Uh, so at the moment you've got this lovely saddle, uh, amount of saddle space, yet the action is absolutely lovely on it. Um, to be honest, we could 
I don't want to sound we could bring that down a little bit, but, but there's absolutely tons of saddle height on that. So for example, there's the saddle height right now, there. Uh, and um, if you look at the action, definitely can get that down. Um, no problem at all. But there's so much saddle height, it's, it's ridiculous. So we can, we've got tons of room to make that work. Okay, um, thanks very much. That's it, see you soon, bye.